Hi everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix inactive conversion tracking in Google Ads. So first of all, you have to log in into your Google Ads. It's very easy. You have to just uh, type in a Google Chrome and type here Google Ads and just hit the enter button and just click on this and you will be able to click on sign in and make sure that whatever your email address is same that you have made your Google accounts, then you have to log in and you will be into your Google Ads, right? Once you're here, just go to the goal section. Once you go into the goal section, you will find here that why uh, your inactive conversion is happening. You will see in the status inactive. So this is the reason why it happens. So if I just hover my mouse to inactive section, we will see that we haven't verified your tag yet, which usually take up to three hours after someone visits your page containing the tag. To help speed this up, you can visit the page to trigger the tag, right? So first of all, we will just click on troubleshoot. Well, once we click on the troubleshoot, it will um it will just give information that how you can set up your tag assistant it will says that tag assistant uh, by the way i will show you in uh, further of the video tag assistant will open in a new tab then connect to your website with tag assistant test the conversion so you have to just follow this all steps right make sure you just read it we will just uh, click on continue right and once we click on continue we will be redirected to the google tag assistance if you're not then just go to the google uh, tool section and here you will find this option of google tags and you will able to open it right so once you're here you will it will ask your website url so for example i will just write here um, i will just write here my okay and make sure that https is uh, mandatory so i will just copy this i will paste here it will be great if you just open your website here and then just uh, copy the link and paste it here then we will click on connect then it will open this uh, you, you can see that my uh, website is trying to open but my website is not live that's why we are, we are getting this error by the way in the background it will say is that connecting to the window to the closest.com basically your website right once we once it done you have to just click on install once you click on the install uh, it will just load for a few seconds and you have to add to the brief so basically it's the extension right so we'll just click on add extension and here it will show so it will download and here you can see that let me just paint this up and here you will find that basically it is now installed right so it is already installed now we will if you just click on install then it will just redirect to you the same google chrome extension right so it's nothing new so uh, uh my website is not like that's why it's not connecting but in your case it will connect in a just few seconds if, if your website is live so make sure your website is live and uh, that's it so here it says that can't connect to the website you the reason which i've already stated and once you connect to the website you have to just copy it and that's it then it will work perfectly fine so this is it guys i hope you found this video very interesting if you did make sure to like this video subscribe 